Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I am doing my first Halloween tutorial. How exciting. So to start off this Halloween tutorial, I am going to be taking my Take Me to Brazil palette and I'm just going to be using the yellow shade as my transition color. Now switching palettes to my 35 Frost palette by Morphe, I am going to be taking that kind of brown reddish shade and I'm just going to be applying that shade over top of the transition color. That's just going to help everything blend together and once I'm done with that I'm going to be taking that darker brown shade and I'm just going to be applying that over my whole lid. Then switching palettes to the Too Faced Natural Matte palette I am going to be taking the shade Sexpresso and I'm just going to be applying it over my whole lid starting from the bottom and then slowly taking it to the top. Super easy. Once I'm done applying it, I go ahead and simply blend everything together. And then after that, for my brow bone, I'm going to be using Heaven from the Too Faced Natural Matte Palette. And I'm just going to be applying it to my brow bone, of course. And then for lashes, I'm going to be using the Color Black Mascara. And for my actual lashes, the fake lashes, I'm going to be using the Mesmerizing Fake Lashes from the Halloween section. And then for the under part of the eyes, I'm going to be applying the yellow shade and then the brown shade from the Morphe palette. And then from for the glitter, I'm going to be using that adhesive which I got from the Halloween section in Walmart. Um, and I'm just going to be applying that on my lower lash line and also in my inner corner. And then for glitter, I also got that glitter at Walmart, it's, which is extra fine. So I totally recommend it because I love it so much. Even the color is super pretty. It's like a champagne-y kind of color. And well, yeah, once I'm done applying the glitter to my lower part of the eye, I'm going to be applying mascara. Now for the fun part, I'm just going to be trying to trace my cheekbone with a random black eyeliner. Just kind of doing it in feathering motion. Not too harsh and I'm going to be doing the same thing for the bottom part. Now using the cream makeup that I got from the Halloween section in color black, I'm going to be taking that with my Anastasia number 12 brow brush and I'm just going to be trying to do lines exactly where my teeth are. I'm, as you can see in the video, I'm trying to open my mouth a little bit and then check and then draw a little line just to know how much space I want to have in between. Then once I'm done with that, I am going to be trying to draw the teeth and what I did here is I took Desi's advice. I am pretty much trying to draw Hershey's kisses so just make sure you don't close the little triangle, you leave it open and also make sure you pass the little line that you did and then once you're done with that you just start blending everything in low motion just so you won't make a mistake. Now for the teeth from the outer corner, I just um, colored them black just because I wanted them to match with my cheekbone. So yeah, and I make sure that I did them kind of sharp and big and really black. Now here I'm taking my Scandalize eyeshadow stick or crayon from Rimmel in the color black and I'm just drawing a line inside my lips. And that's just going to define where the where the teeth separate and now I'm taking the same crayon but in color white and I'm just pretending like I'm cream contouring and I'm making that line and now I'm just going to be filling in everything which should be pretty easy since we had already outlined everything. By the way I got my inspiration from tutorials by Tina. Um, I really liked how she did her cheekbone so that's why I kind of like copied her in a way but I instead of doing the white line I decided to put glitter in it and yeah. I'll go ahead and link her video down below just in case anyone wants to go see her video. So now taking the black from the Take Me to Brazil palette, I'm just going to be intensifying the black just because it wasn't as black as I wanted it to. So I'm going to be intensifying the inside of my lips, the teeth, the cheekbones and everything and once I'm done with that I'm going to go ahead and take the paint again and I'm going to start doing the nose shape and for that I kind of like just did like a little triangle on the bottom and then two little lines. I don't know how to explain, explain this so you guys can see it. Um, and once I was done with that I went ahead and intensified it with the black shadow from the Take Me to Brazil palette. Yeah. 
Now for the glitter part, I'm going to be taking the adhesive that I used earlier and I'm just going to be applying it inside of every um, tooth and then I'm going to be applying the same glitter. A tip for this would be to use really thin brushes and also take your time if you don't want to mess it up. And if you do mess it up, it's okay. You can just go back with the black liner and then just go over top of the glitter and it should be fixed. So, no worries. And it's okay if it's not perfect because, I mean, what counts is that you try your best. Like me, I mean, mine wasn't perfect, but I tried my best. So I'm doing the same thing for the cheekbone, for the line. I am just going to be tracing it with the glue and then I'm going to be applying the glitter over top. And now using the Take Me to Brazil palette again, I'm going to be using that yellow shade and I'm just going to be applying it on top of the shadow that we made for the cheekbone. And that's just going to bring something to the look. I don't know, I really liked it. I didn't show the clip, but I also applied it to my forehead. And now I'm going to be using that little, I don't know what that, that's called, but I got it from Walmart. And it has little stars in it. And I'm just going to be applying those stars as freckles. So I'm just going to be applying dots of glitter, I mean dots of glue. And then I'm just going to be applying the stars on top of the glue. And that is it, you guys. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to tag me on your recreations. And I'll see you next time. Bye.